Okay, so welcome to week five. I'm hoping that everything is going well and that uh, you are getting into a routine with your e-learning. So before I go on to what we're doing this week, I just want to briefly review what we did last week. Um, hopefully you figured out that computers are used all the time and they impact your life in, in a lot of different ways. Um, on Wednesday, when we have our face-to-face, -face, we will be going over the answers to the software worksheet. The answers for the quiz are pretty much straight up what the uh, vocabulary was, so I'm not going to take time and do that, but I will go over the answers to the software quiz so that we can have discussions about ones you have questions on. Okay, so now we're going to go to this week. Okay, so we're going to be, um, it's pretty much all set up the same way. You will have an intro to week five. It will be Monday at 11 a.m. You'll have three assignments, and then there is the voluntary face-to-face um, -face on Wednesday. By the way, this is voluntary also, the uh, Monday one. It is solely for you. Um, I will be going over basically this video, and I will review the software um, worksheet. Okay, so... We're going to be talking this time about netiquette and etiquette, which means how you are polite, why it's important to be polite when you're writing emails. So the essential question for the week is how can we be polite when writing emails? Um, like I said, face-to-face -face is um, Monday at 11 is the overview, and Wednesday at 11 we will be reviewing the software. So this week your um, objective is to know how to be polite when using electronic communication. You'll understand the parts of an email and then you'll practice writing one. You'll determine your typing speed and compare it to your goal. And then you will also upload a screenshot to OneDrive. So, assignment one, um, let's see, we're going to go, we're just going to go in here so that I don't have to do it twice. So, if you go to week five, assignment one. You'll have your intro video. There is a PowerPoint that you need to watch. You need to watch this PowerPoint. That will give you the answers to the Kahoot. So if you click on the actual assignment, it says you're going to click here and you're going to go to Kahoot about email etiquette. Listen carefully. When you go to Kahoot, if you do not put your first initial and last name and period number, you will not get credit. If I cannot look and see your first initial, first name initial, last name, and your period number, I cannot grade it. I'm not going to go looking for you. So you're going to click here. You're going to get to the Kahoot. It automatically takes you to where you need to be. And then here where it says enter nickname, you need to put in your first initial, your last name, and your period. So it should look something like this. And then hit OK Go and go ahead and do it. All right. So that is assignment one. Assignment two, you're going to actually be writing 
some emails. You're going to, I'm going to show you um, the different parts of an email, and then you are going to um, fix an email. You're going to take a screenshot of it, and you're going to upload it to the assignments. So first, you're going to watch the PowerPoint. This one here is examples of what you have to do here. This is the intro video to this assignment. And here you are going to, here's your assignment, all right? So your assignment is, is you have to fix an email. You have to submit a screenshot. So over here where you have submissions, you have to put a screenshot of the fixed email. Do not send it to me. Do not upload it. Do not, I need a screenshot. We are reinforcing the skills that you're learning. So basically, if you click on PowerPoint, uh, on this example, it's going to come up in the bottom. It'll open up and there are two emails. The first email is the bad email. This is not correct. It should have so much more in it. If you click on the second slide and you can click in here and you can type and you can put in all of the stuff that you need to put in. When you are done with this slide, you need to take a screenshot. However, you take a screenshot, snipping tool, um, print screen, whatever it is, and then you will submit that screenshot in assignment five. Also, just an FYI, I put it in the video, but if this is on this yellow bar, you need to click enable editing or you will not be able to type. So you make sure you hit enable editing. Okay, so you have to do that. Now, there is a part of t this lesson that you do not have to turn in right now. Remember how we made, we went to OneDrive and we made our folders. We made our intro to computer apps and we made quarter one and images. Well, I want you to take the image that you, the snipping, the screenshot of this email and load it onto OneDrive in your quarter one folder. Okay. You do not have to send me anything. This is not graded right now. It will be graded at the end of the quarter when I ask you to take a picture of your OneDrive. Okay, so you will follow the directions if you go back here to assignment three. Oh no, sorry, assignment two, sorry got ahead of myself. Assignment two, and then I put a folder on uploading a file to OneDrive. In the video, I also talk about it and show you how to do it, but I have a separate video here. And last but not least is week, th I mean, uh, assignment three, and we're going to be working on typing. Remember, I told you every other week we would do something to do with typing. So you're going to, t uh, you're going to actually report to me what your typing test times are now and and what your goal is and then do you think you're going to make it have you been practicing is the goal too high too low whatever so what you're going to do is you're going to go over here to submit you're going to copy and paste this sentence, my typing speed after five weeks, is you're going to copy it and then you will paste it in your submission and you fill it in. So it's fill in the blank. Whatever your typing speed is on typing test, you put there. Whatever your goal is that I sent you, you put there. And then here you put will or will not. If you think your, t your, um, goal is too high, you can make me a sentence and let me know that. Remember, I'm not going to penalize you for not reaching your goal. This is about you getting better. 
but you need to get better. All right, so that is what we are doing for the week. So week um, five is um, you're going to watch the video and do the Kahoot. You're going to watch the video and you're going to fix an email based on what you learn in the video and then submit a screenshot. And then over here, you're going to submit that one sentence after you take the typing test. If you have any questions, let me know. And if not, have a wonderful week.